Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today we'll be playing Build a Bolt for Treasure, and we are on to the tutorial of how to make this bolt bike. So, last video we made a tutorial on how to create the yellow neon bike, and now we're on to this one. So, let me just delete the mechanical. Alright, so, first things first, you want to start with the front wheel like, again. So. You make your rotation 15 at no 5 and then like probably three blocks off of the ground and then use plastic if you want and then do that same th rotate it like this until it reaches its original one so that once you've done that you will have the same rotated blocks like all inside of each other and then after that um like it takes quite the amount of time so let's say you would do this for all rotated blocks. Scale it upwards by um, two, and then downwards like that. And then also do it this way, and oh no, just and then also you would also um, extend it horizontally. And then so let's say we so this is an example of one of the rotations. So so far you'd have this probably. Oh no, you keep rotating it like this until it reaches its original rotation twice so after that scale all of it in and then let's say take this rotation for an example um scale it like that and then keep doing it for all of the rotations until you make it a full circle and smooth it out by like probably 0 0.05 and then you'll have your first wheel so after that you want to um you want to duplicate it by bringing it to the stage and then let's see how many blocks apart are these wheels like about five four to five blocks away and then anchor that of course and then make sure it's there delete the cake seat everything else and then you want to connect them so let's first get rid of this Alright, so, oh yeah, you want to take the, one of the rotations, it's, it depends on how you do, how you'd like it, but don't make it too, like, steep like that, or too low like this, you want to keep it efficient, and then, scale it upwards like that, and then, obviously, fill in the holes, and then make it smooth. And then, now to can oh yeah, and if you want to add this neon stuff, just like turn on match rotation, and then keep scaling it like that. It takes a really long time. So actually you can do it with the first one and then duplicate it, so you don't have to do it um, again. So just keep doing it for everyone, but with neon blocks, not plastic blocks. So yeah, and then make sure it's 0.5. The width is 0.5. Alright, and then... And, yeah, do it for this other side as well. And make sure, like, it's a good distance from each other. Whatever makes you happy with it. And then... Take the one that's exactly 90 degrees. And then scale it... F um, forward by, like... One block or so. And then give it a sort of tail. Uh, like that by turning on match rotation and then after that do the same rotation as like what you did the yellow neon one whatever makes you happy so but you can also like scale it that way if you want and then so you just do it for both sides okay after you make that rotation like right over here um Make sure you also have like sort of a rectangular prism base just to make it give it that like sort of body shape. And then do the same thing on the other side by with the rotations. And then also give it handles like it is like how it looks like in jailbreak. And then give it two rotations just like this one sort of. Oh wait, no, this one doesn't have it. But the jailbreak, new, the new jailbreak volt bike does. And then, um, 
So you just make sure it looks like this, any way you want though. And I just left this out like this because I had a cool tiger seat, sort of. And then, well, it just looked cool. <laughs> and then after that, we're on to the mechanics part. So it's quite simple actually. Let's say, so you'd probably want it over here. So I might be sort of in the way. So you can do that. And then you can do that. And then, oh, we have a visitor. Hello. And then you place the chair just like, oh no, and it's got a down one. So it looks like, wait, how does this look like first? And then, oh my god, okay, this guy. Sorry about that, but let's get back to the mechanics part. So you want to put a block where the base was and then like scale it a bit forward or backwards and then well let's see how this looks first see and see if it looks like we're right on sitting right on top of it oh yep see we're a bit too high so let's scale it down like that and move this out of the way and see how this looks yeah wait beautiful and then scale this back And now you're done with the seat, of course. And now onto the ch the wheels. It's sort of the same thing as the other one. Just like there's a block in the center. But obviously you won't have a center if you're gonna um but place it first based off of like one of the rotations. So you can take this actually first and then scale it by a little bit. And then place a block like that. Sort of. And then you can place the wheel just like that and I do the same thing on the other side and if you want to give it a trail um and you want it all to match you can just make oh yeah and also the neon stuff turn on match rotation and then rotate this on um, 45 degrees into it on like the third like curve and then do it up to a new one that until it makes it happy and then and obviously make sure you did the handles and then after that you want to actually scale it back and then turn on match rotation and then divide it into two and make sure it's 1.5 wide uh blocks wide and then uh make sure there's like a gap in between and then place the like neon over here and then you can rotate it once again to give it a sort of little curve and then i think this is actually made of neon no never mind okay and then so yeah do the same thing on the front of the wheels and then you can do that same harpoon trick see sit again in case you didn't see another video it's right here so sit and then cake and then plastic block and then Point four, scale it down by point four, and then just do it until it, um, like as many harpoons as you can that you want for the bike. And then just anchor all of this. Not uh, unanchor all of it. And then just, you can just anchor that. Alright, and then get it in the right position. So that's coming right out of it. And then a chair. And then you can use a portal. Just like that. And then you're done. Just make it invisible, anchor everything. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video, and I hope this was helpful. Bye!